What's up YouTube? So I just want to do a quick video for you guys on mobile here because I'm not at my desk at the moment but I want to show you a current trade that I'm in that I've entered uh, about two hours ago. It's a pretty simple breakout trade here on Euro USD. I'm trading this on Prime XPT. I'm shortening it on Oanda but I'm, but I'm trading it on uh, Prime XPT. The levels should be uh, very uh, close on Prime XPT and Oanda. So I'm just gonna go through what I'm seeing here on EURUSD, why I took this trade. It's a bit risky obviously because it's more like a breakout trade. Uh, but if like I'm, I, I was able to actively uh, watch this one. So I figured uh, it kind of looks like it wants to come up and test these highs here, right? We got these last highs here where we got the reaction strong 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 reaction and 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 a powerful move down of that reaction right so that's obviously a very important powerful area if you zoom out you will see that it's also historically a very interesting area right to take some profits if um, if this current breakout move that we're seeing will continue to the upside there's a big chance that we will go up and test that area again and that's where i want to take some profits right so that's just the overall um uh, overall idea right and now I'm gonna zoom in to uh, the lower the lower time frames to really show you uh, what I'm looking for in terms of entry so this red box here is a resistance area right and I've been seeing you know we saw this breakout here we did trade this breakout in the bird nest right so we saw this uh, breakout out of this area here right these highs here we kind of broke out of uh, broke out of this range. Man, shorting on phone is, is complicated, but I wanted to do this on phone because I needed to get this video out as quickly as possible because I'm not going to be at my desk in a couple of hours and I want you guys to be as updated as possible. So we were trading inside inside this range, right? And uh, we broke out of this range now and now I'm looking for a continuation up to this high time frame resistance here. So going down into the four hour, the one hour, sorry, we are seeing a breakout out of this range. And I was looking at these highs right here. I wouldn't enter on these highs. I did, right? And I did enter when we had the one hour open and close above this resistance, confirming it uh, broken, right? So what I did was I will put in some orders on the retest here. This is obviously a little bit riskier because it's more like a breakout trade. If you were wanting to, you know, long the retest after a breakout, you would most likely look at the four hour, wait for the four hour close, uh, open and close above, then long the retest of like this general area down here. But this is more like a bit riskier trade, low, lower risk. I uh, wanted to long the, the, the entry, like long the retest of this, these highs right here, right? For a move up towards this area up here, the 1.11400, right? So that's what I'm looking at right now. Go down into the 50 minute and you can kind of see how price is trying to get above here, right? It's really trying to get above. Let's see. And uh, yeah, as long as we break above this area, 1.11100, uh, uh, we will most likely go up and take a profit, uh, take profit one. If we close, like if we reclaim that area, this area, I will move my stop uh, to uh, to this area to limit my losses. Right. So that's what I'm looking at, guys. Thanks you for thanks for watching, and see you uh, in my next video. Take care, guys.